So the second generation of our BM1235 is uh, renewed, so we uh, listen to our customer and improve the machine on necessary points. We reduce it by 1.5 tons to allow the machine to be transported with uh, less effort in the permissions. We increased the visibility in the front by optimizing the shape of the water tank in front that the operator get a clear view to the working area. We considered also the comfort level that we make the operation of the machine easier by reorganization of some functions. We implemented as well the Bomark Easy Leveling with the second generation of the Dash 35, Dash 15, which is our new harmonized uh, way to operate the machines. When we talk about serviceability, the machine is made in a way that the most important things are accessible from the ground. So here, for example, we have access to the valve block on the conveyor belt in front. So if something happened or you have to check before job site or after job site, you can clearly access on the site, you can check if everything is working well. If you have to do maintenance on the diesel filter, you can slew it out, you can put something underneath so the machine itself will not pollute by diesel when you do the cleaning of the diesel filter. Some job sites requiring that the lag on such a machine has to slew in and the operator get a better view to the side door and get more clearance. Our design is made on a very reliable design. Banded on this uh, slew lag mechanism, it's hooked into the frame. So that means when the lag has to be slewed in, the machine lowers, the wheel comes down, moved over and hooked into the frame. So every load is going from the column into the frame and that's the reason why we're giving a 5,000 hours warranty or 60 months which is appearing first on the slew mechanism to keep the, or guaranteeing the integrity of the machine while driving with the lag in or out that you still can steer the machine. So with the Bomag Easy Level, as we see on the display, you have a big 7-inch color display. You have clearly structured the different values which you need during the milling process. The intention is to have very short uh, ways to set the different values. So actually the machine is set on two side doors for the left and right side. To adjust the two sensors together, I just push one button, the second button, operation done. Then I can go for my settings, a milling depth. If I start one button, automation system starting, and I can adjust and both values are operating together. Comfort is very mandatory on such a machine. The operator working straight, he can adjust the seat. So on one side he can pull down the knees and can turn 45 degrees. So in this position he can see clearly the way he has to operate and he can check on the back side comfortable how the pattern looks like. So you're sitting far away from the steering wheel, feel a bit uncomfortable, so you can start and adjust it to you. Then if you need some additional view to the side, because you're milling a longer distance, you have a second slope area and then you're sitting 20, uh, close, close to 20 centimeters more to the side and have a much more better view to the front. Some operators really like to work in the opera uh, standing operation, so then you have the possibility to adjust the seat more to the back, you stay up, keep the armrest on the side and lifting up the operator panel and then you can operate the machine comfortable also in the standing position. So we improved the front of the machine to get a better visibility, especially to maneuver the machine much more on the narrow job sites. And if you have to steer the machine very close to some obstacles, you exactly see where the machine ends in front of the machine. It helps the operator a lot to be less stressed during the operation.